Hey, half a day. Happy Friday, by the way, the weekend upcoming. I'm Blake Watson. Welcome to PNC Sports Now. A 5K in a Ganya early tomorrow morning. More on that in just a bit. But first, last night, GSPN's preseason tournament finals took shape. It will be GW versus Ukudu. To get to the big game, the Ukudu Bulldogs had to overcome the defending champs from last season, FD. Here's more. Father Duenas and Ukudu High School. These two teams, no strangers to each other on the court. Always exciting contests between these teams, and this no different. In the last two games between them, a single possession has decided the winner. The Bulldogs able to capitalize on an FD miss. They get it the other way. Nice look, easy layup for Ukudu. Bulldogs keeping up with the tempo here. They get the inbound pass. Navigates through some traffic, one end to the other, coast to coast. Some nice moves peppered in, layup is good. Friars, though, keep at it. Persistence is the key. They move the ball around, puts up a prayer from downtown. Offensive rebound, back up for the score. What are friends for, right? Neck and neck the entire game. However, FD can't stop giving up the ball. They turn it over, and it catches up in the end. Bulldogs get the win. They punch their ticket to the finals. 55-53. The end score. Academy of Our Lady of Guam celebrating 65 years of sisterhood this school year. Tomorrow morning will be their 13th annual 5K fund run and walk. Get the pun. I was able to sit down with Academy's development director, Mrs. Joni Cepeda, and ask her all about it. Here's more. 65 years of sisterhood, class of 65 celebrating their 50th reunion and the 13th annual Academy 5K fund run and walk. The school wanted to give back to their alumni in the 5K just the vehicle to do so. We wanted to put an event together for our alumni and the community as well to bring everyone home to the academy. We have a lot of sponsors and benefactors since our inception back in 1946. So we decided let's do something where we also celebrate the 50th anniversary of uh, the graduating class of that particular year for 50 years already and move it forward and then we wanted to do something special to signify that they've reached their 50th anniversary or 50th reunion so we had the passing of the torch and we started with the class of 1953 mm -hmm. which was back in 2003 and we are now in the class of 1965 13 years later. Okay. The course will run through the streets of Hagatnya's historical trail with the starting point next to the school on Archbishop Flores Street. The race will run uh, down the side of Cathedral. Right, turn. Oh, Chalon Santa Papa, mm -hmm. and then you make a ride at West O'Brien all the way down to 9th Street. There will be a water station in front of Chodis, then go straight up onto Marine Drive, and then you will make a right onto West Soledad Avenue. There will be a water station at Staywell. Go down onto Route 4, make a right, and then make a right again on West O'Brien in front of the courts back to the school. Okay, great. And uh, it'll just end right there, I guess, uh, at the back of the parking lot, right? Right. Just right around the corner from where it began. Right. With, again, a big celebration. We have close to 50 door prizes. Proceeds from this event are earmarked for scholarships and tuition assistance. And all proceeds do go into the Academy Scholarship and Tuition Assistance Fund. Interested participants are able to register for the event all the way up until the start of the race on site at 6 a.m. The event will also include a passing of the torch ceremony from the class of 1965. That will occur pre-race. Well, that brings us to the end of the PNC Sports Now report and also the end of the week. I hope you fared well. Stay dry and warm this weekend. Plenty of sports, so get out and catch a game. My name is Blake Watson. In the meantime, PacificNewsCenter.com sports. I'll see you at the game.